Hey guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I will show to make this animation with Duke Angel in After Effects. Let's get started. So friends, welcome back and first step, let's select this character element, select this hand main, hair left, head, body and hair right, foot and hand back. Let's right mouse and select pre compass, add name, character. Click OK. Let's open composition and go to click this icon for select region of interest. And let's select region like this. OK, go to composition and crop come to region of interest. Let's select this. OK, that's good. And let's back to app composition. Select this character, press S, open scale and change scale like this. Move to here. OK, and let's back to character. Let's make rigging for this hand. Let's first select this hand main, go to solo and let's go to puppet pin. Let's add one puppet here, one here and one here. If you not see this mesh, click this checkbox for show or hide. Then click session tool and close settings. Select hand main, go to FS control and select puppet here. Go to window, open Duke Angel and click this icon. When we will select puppet, click add pins and click ignore. OK, we have no three pin. Let's select this puppet pin 3, link to 2, select 2, link to 1. And select puppet pin 1, let's link to body. And let's unsole all layers. Select these three puppets, go to again Duke Angel and go to kinematics, let's click IK. Okay, so select this controller. Let's see. Okay, here we go. So, select this controller, go to icon and change size like this. Okay, so let's close the angel and select this body. Let's press air. Okay, select from behind, move the anchor point down. Clization tool, let's say again. Nice. So right now let's select this head, let's link to body and select this hand back, also link to body. Select head, let's go to solo and click this icon for see background. Select anchor point, let's move to down. Let's unsolo. Let's move to here. Clization tool and let's select this hair left and hair right, link to head. Select head. Press air, let's see. Nice. So, right now we can make animation. Let's first back to app and select this web composition. And go to here, let's press P, move to right like this. And make new pass in keyframe. Go to one second and move to like this here. Okay, and select character, let's move to here. And select this web, let's select keyframes, make easy or click F9. Go to graph editor, let's make graph like this for smooth animation. Back to keyframes, select last keyframe, move to right a little bit. Okay, so let's open web and Select these layers. Let's move the anchor points to left. And let's select these all text layers. Let's see. Okay, and go to window. I will use anchor point mover script. And let's click this icon for move to left all anchor points. Then select this text layer, go to first second, press S, open scale and click this icon, make scale keyframe, go to 10 keyframe, change scale like this, go to 10 keyframe, change like this and go to 10 keyframe again 
and select three frames let's control c control v for duplicate all three frames also we can use loop alteration for loop animation but it's not loop okay select all three frames and right mouse again easy is then select the scale let's control c select this text and select all text layers press s and control v for paste three frames let's close three frames and select these text layers let's move to right like this let's see okay let's select this layer press s and control v for paste three frames and this okay So let's go to here and select work area, right mouse and let's use come to work area. Okay, nice. So back to app conversation. Okay, so let's back to character and select this controller. Let's go to first second, press P, make new person chip frame and move to down. Go to some three frames, move to like this, and go to here. Let's make random three frames. Okay, back to here. Let's see. Okay, in this time we can make hand click animation. Let's back to character and make new passing three frame. Go to ten three frame. Let's move to like this. Go to ten three frame again. Let's click this second for see background. Make click animation. Let's see. Let's see here. Okay. And let's move the up hand. Okay, and go to 3G frame, 1 to 3, move to left, go to 3G frame, 1 to 3, move to right for bones hand animation. Okay, we have problem with last 3G frames, let's select all G frames, right mouse, G frame interpolation, change auto bezier to linear, click OK, let's say again. Okay, select last G frames. Let's move to left and hold Alt, move to right. Okay, nice. And go to here, make new passing chief frame, go to some chief frames and move to down hand like this. Okay, so back to here, select first chief frame and let's move to down hand. Okay, and let's select this hand, let's move to back. Okay, let's back to composition. Nice. And back to character. In this time, select this body, press R, make rotation chain frame, and chain rotation minus 3. In this time, let's chain rotation like this. Make new rotation, go to here, chain like this. Select chain frames, make easy. Let's see. Okay, and make new rotation. Go to here. Chain rotation like this. And change rotation again. Four. Nice. Go to four chain frame. One, two, three, four. Change. Two. Go to four chain frame again. Change again fall like this select last shift frame hold alt move to right let's see nice and let's go to first second select this body let's add bones hold shift press p make new passing chief frame and go to center move to down body go to last shift frame and select first shift frame copy pass select chief frames make easy let's see Okay, that's more realistic. 
So select the last three keyframes, Ctrl C, go to here, Ctrl V. Nice, and again Ctrl V here. Let's see. Okay, more dynamic, not bad. So select this here, make rotation keyframe, chain rotation like this. And go to here, chain rotation. Select keyframes, make easies. And in this time, make new rotation keyframe. Go to again, and change like this. Go to some keyframes, make new rotation. And this all keyframe is random. You can make your keyframes hold to like you. And let's change rotation again like this. Okay, so go to first second, select this here, hold shift, press P. Let's add bones for here. Make passing keyframe, go to here, move to down, and go to last keyframe, select first keyframe, copy pass, and make keyframes easy. And copy, go to here, and this time control V, and here control V. Let's see. Nice. So let's back to main composition, let's see here. Okay, nice. Dynamic character animation, not bad. And in this time, let's open web composition and select this red layer. Let's press S, make sketch shape frame, go to 6 shape frame, let's click here and write plus 6, click OK and change scale 95 or 90. Go to 6 shape frame again, let's click here, write plus 6, click OK and say first shape frame, copy pass. Say shape frames make easiest. Let's see. Okay, and right now select this circle and play, let's link to red layer and select this play layer. Let's press air, open rotation, make rotate shape frame and go to here, chain rotation, for example, eight or 10 and go to here, change rotation minus five and go to here, change zero. Select rotation keyframes, make easiest. And let's see animation. Nice. And select keyframes, let's hold Alt, move to right, and this, move to right. Okay, back to app conversation. Let's see here. Nice. So, thank you for watching my video, and don't forget to subscribe to channel, like video, and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.